It's a bird. It's a plane. No. It's the BAM Geek Box from May of 2022. What's up, YouTube? Zero here. Today I have the BAM Geek Box from 2022, and I'm ready to get this opened. I hope you're as excited as I am about opening this crate. So as I'm opening up this box with my handy dandy pocket knife, be careful with knives, kids. I accidentally cut my thumb the other day opening up another package. But be careful as I'm opening up this package. Feel free to give this video a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more mystery box unboxing content. I do a bunch of video game content as well, so feel free to check that out. It does really help out me and my channel. Thank you so much in advance for doing so. Without further ado, we are greeted by our BAM wallpaper. That's right, if you didn't know, not only does this act as a cover for our BAM box, but it also acts as some nice wallpaper if you wanted to cover your walls with BAM paper. Don't waste paper, it is not very friendly. So our first item out of the box is our cheat sheet. So I'm gonna put that over to the side right now. Honestly, I'm being hit in the face by our pins so let's take a look we actually have and we have a key so i have a key a pin and another pin so this pin is actually from the last box this is one of our doctor strange pins so i do remember that in the last box they only gave us one pin it was supposed to be a set so we got our second pin the eye of agmoto in its all cool decked out form so we could check that out real quick, supposed to be in the last box. And then we actually have a Darth Vader pin from our Obi-Wan series. So this is absolutely awesome. I am a huge Star Wars fan. So this is sweet. We got Vader. Then we got our two Stormtroopers next to him, which is awesome. That is a really badass pin. And then we actually have our prop replica. This is from our lock and key TV series on Netflix. I actually really love this series and this key is actually really sweet. Especially if you're a key collector. I love lock and key. I heard they were doing a third season, which may be their last. Hopefully not because it's a great series and a great comic series if you're interested in comic books that's where it's mimicked off of the comic series is really awesome and also a lot more gruesome if you're into reading comics and seeing the graphic novels so this key is really cool and so are the pins i'm loving this vader pin and we're gonna check out what our cheat sheet says after we go through everything but let's take a look we got our Bob's Burgers print, and that is a really cool print. If you are into Bob's Burgers, really funny TV show, you can see here, we got our different characters chilling, surfing, and it is a great picture for this time of year. We're going into June. This box is from May. It's time to hit the beach. Surf's up. So go to the beach and just start chilling. This is a nice print. I love the prints that Bambox does because the colors are always on point and popping. We got it autographed down here by the artist. And this is actually 28 of 500. So that's a really low number. Pretty close to number one. So a great print. And then we got our certificate of authenticity on the back. So a really nice print. And now our last item from the box we got mighty ducks this is badass look at this we actually have multiple autographs not just one but we got number 11 number four and number five i can't read who these autographs are so i'm actually just gonna look right on our cheat sheet and take a look so we have jane plank aaron schwartz and matt doherty and that is really badass. Just we got the three autographs all around the print. The yellow with the Mighty Ducks really pops. This is such a cool print. I'm really loving this. This is awesome. Takes me back to my Mighty Duck days when I was a kid. Remember, it's knuckle puck time. 
We're gonna call in a flying V in a second, but this print is absolutely awesome. I gotta hang this up somewhere, probably in my sports room. I have different rooms. I have a horror room, a Harry Potter room, a Star Wars room. This is going in my sports room, and this is absolutely awesome. So I'm loving this print. So that's it from the box. It's time to take a look at the cheat sheet to see what we got and what the variants could have been in this box. So first, let's take a look at the autograph. And as I'm going into this, let me know in the comments section what your favorite item from the box was. And if you see a variant you would have liked better, let me know in the comments section as well. But let's get into it. Let's talk about the aut autograph where we have our three actors, which is awesome. The triple, the triple deke. So let's take a look at our variants. We have the yellow print, the Mighty Ducks, or we could have gotten the variant with the Mighty Ducks across the middle, the team on the bottom, and the mask up top. Me? This is awesome. I think the one I got a lot better than the other one, but you may like the other one. I just like this one a lot more than the other one. I think it looks awesome. Y'all, if you've seen my videos before, you know I like the poster style prints, and this one is my favorite of the two, so I'm happy with that one. Now, for the key, the prop replica, let's move down a little bit, could have been one of three. The Omega key, which is the one I got, the head or the echoes, no sorry, I got, they didn't do it in order, I got the head key. So let's take a look, that's obviously the Omega key, even though they list this as Omega head and echo, that has to be Omega because that's the Omega symbol, I'm assuming because mine's a head, I got the head key. Right here, I got the head key and then the echo key. I'm gonna take a wild guess if that's the echo key since this is the head, that's an omega. Final choice is that is the echo. So which one is your favorite of the three? From a distance, the omega is the easiest to read, but I definitely like the head key. It has a lot of detail in it if you see up close. If you're a key collector, this is one that is absolutely amazing. A lot of detail, really nice key. So I'm gonna say I like the one I got the best. But all three keys are absolutely fantastic. So now let's take a look at our pin. So it could have been one or two. It could have been Vader or it could have been Obi-Wan. Now both are fantastic. It would have been nice to get both of them because in crates prior we have gotten two pins so it would have been nice to get both and if there was a variant in the box it would have actually been a glitter variant both are absolutely cool vader one of the baddest dudes in the galaxy and obi-wan one of the best jedi in the galaxy for this i am more of an obi-wan fan so i probably would have preferred obi-wan over vader but come on it's vader i'm not disappointed with if either honestly regardless of the one i got i got the vader which i'm really happy with vader is one of my favorite villains in any universe so i love the vader pin i would have preferred the Obi one because i'm more of a hero type person but both are absolutely fantastic and now let's check out the art print where I did get the variant. We'll take a look at this variant. So you can see the two different ones. The Chase variant is actually one where it's more at dusk. So that is absolutely cool. Honestly, I love this Chase variant a lot more than the normal one because it just makes the colors pop a little bit more. It's at dusk, you got the red in the background, the water of the ocean in the foreground, and then you have your Ferris wheel in the background. The other one is nice, it's during the daytime, but I like the pop of the dusk time, being on the beach, going surfing, absolutely fantastic. All of the items in this crate did not disappoint. That is an awesome crate that we had a bunch of cool items in. So let me know in the comments section what your favorite item was. My favorite item from this crate 
is going to have to be the Vader pin. I'm a huge Star Wars fan. I absolutely am loving the Obi-Wan series. If you haven't checked it out yet, I recommend checking it out. And if you have checked it out, let me know in the comment section what you're thinking of it so far. This is my favorite item from the box. Let me know in the comment section what your favorite item from this box was. I hope you have a great rest of your day. I hope you enjoyed this video. And until next time, peace.